Yo. Yo, man, you ain't hear me knocking on your door? I've been asleep. Sleep, nigga, it's 3 o'clock in the afternoon. If you don't get up. All right, all right. What's up, bro? You hominating or some shit? How come I haven't heard from you? Hey, where's your mom at? I want to say hello. She's been gone for like the past two weeks. I had to take care of my grandmother. She ain't feeling too well. well. She must be doing better than you. Ever since you broke up with Camille, you've been on some sad boy wave. What are you even doing every day? <laughs> Nothing. I'm just focusing on myself. I didn't break up with her. She cheated on me. Look at yourself. When was the last time you slept with the do-rag on? You're really not giving a fuck. Yo, you need to start taking care of yourself. Nigga, you can't just tell me what to think and say now. I can't, but this will. It's a pick-me-up. Nigga, what? You see where I'm at and you're anxious to pop some pills? No, these aren't just any pills, bro. These are the gateway to full-blown enlightenment. Make some sense before I kick you the fuck out. They're not FDA approved, but once the government figures out how to profit off them, they will be. But I do you wrong. I don't do drugs, bro. I'm not gonna take an antidepressant. James, I took them. What? Why? You remember how it was after Marcus passed away? He was my biggest inspiration. Literally relied on him for everything. Once my bro passed, I didn't know what to do with myself. I didn't tell you about it, but these pills right here, they helped me get through. And look at me now. <laughs> here. Remember, once the drug leaves the receptor, you'll always come back. Pick me up pills, my ass. What are you? <laughs> Nigga, what? I'm you. Well, I'm the better you. And from what it looks like, a way better you. I don't follow. See you like this. 
I'm the new iOS update of yourself. Except I'm cooler, funnier, and just not a pussy. This was supposed to help me get my life back together. Can anyone even see you? Nope. Just you. Which makes it even better because people will think you did it all by yourself. Great. So I took drugs. I can talk to ghosts. I'm so proud of myself. I'm <laughs> not technically a ghost. I can't walk through walls or fly. My anatomy and physical makeup are similar to a human being, except I'm just a hallucination. So I can't run my hands through your body. Ayo, first, pause. Second, we shouldn't make any physical contact. At least not yet. I'm the only person who knows you better than you know yourself, and I very well intend on exploiting the good parts. What are you doing? Playing dress up. Okay. You took another one? What should I say to her? What? what are you saying? Hold up. Come on, man. Not the better version of you work. <sighs> Ooh, shit. She's calling for a virtual date. What? Fuck. We ain't ready for that. All right, we're going to switch real quick so she can see me. You're going to grab my hand and forearm just like this. After she falls in love with you, well, me. You switch back. Quick, she's gonna change her mind. <laughs> Pick up. Ooh, about that. I ain't going anywhere. Nigga, what the fuck? I thought you were gonna help me become the better me. And I am. I'm literally the better version of you, metaphorically, and, well, now, physically. Ooh, come on, you gotta have to be faster than that. <laughs> oh, it's happening. Goodbye. No. Oh. God, no. What the fuck is going on, man? What'd you give me? Yo, calm down, James. Where are we? The fuck? Breathe, man. <laughs> that wasn't me. My old self introduced you to the pills. After Marcus passed, I was really lost. I put my faith in those awful pills. Who gave them to you? Ironically enough, my therapist. What? Why would your therapist do something like that? Come on, take a guess. It was his ult. Isn't the ult's purpose is to spread them to anyone feeling any level of depression. They're like some sort of sadistic missionaries. Oh, look, it's my therapist. <laughs> so where are we? Man, these poor helpless souls just wander around here reminiscing on the life they once knew. Or conjuring up conspiracy theories as to who's administering the drug. My guess is the government. That guy right there? 
call him suicide, Sam. Why? Every day, he finds a new way to kill himself, hoping that he'll be with his family one day. Every morning, he wakes up with hope, and every night, he falls asleep with despair. So where the fuck are we? There's no way to run or life to go back towards anymore. We're in limbo. It's not that bad.